Good morning, good morning, good morning, and happy Friday. Oh, yes, we made it again. God did it again. A beautiful morning this morning here in the 757. We may get some rain today. It's a little overcast this morning, and they say the weekend probably be a little wet, but we are just grateful, just grateful to see another day. If you can, get out and get you a nice brisk walk this morning. Like I said, it's a little cooler here in the 757, but just right, might need a little light jacket. But God is good. You know, on Fridays, I like to do my praise nugget. And all I want to say today, in every and all things, give thanks. <laughs> in everything, I like the way they say it, Ebonics. In everything and in all things, give thanks. In all circumstances, give thanks thanks. I know a lot of times we say, thank God it's Friday, but we need to thank God for every day, everything, all things. Because you know why? Even when things are not going that well, all things work together for good for those that love God and are called according to his purpose. But you just need to give God thanks because, oh my gosh, we serve a great God, an awesome God. I tell you, like the song, psalm says, if we had a thousand tongues, we couldn't praise them enough. And, you know, you just can't um, thank them just when things are going good. That's like, that's what First Thessalonians 5.18 says. In everything, give thanks for, in everything, give thanks because guess what? This is the will of God in Christ Jesus concerning you. We're supposed to give thanks, <laughs> you know. It, it, it says it right here because it, it, it is his will to give thanks unto the Lord. Let's give him thanks. Let's say thank you. And in every, every situation. All right. That's all I got to say today. That's all that I have to say today in everything and in every situation. You know, I, I ran across a peanut's. A cartoon, you know, Charlie Brown and all. They said, what if today you just give God thanks for everything? Just for even in one day. You couldn't even thank him for everything even in a day. But what if you just don't, don't, don't complain about nothing, don't, don't worry about nothing, just give thanks. Because you know what? I still believe it. <laughs> that when the praises... And when the thank yous go up, oh my gosh, all the blessings come down. I told you once before, I, I believe God blesses me because God be sitting up there and say, let, let me see what I can do for her so she can give me some more thanks. <laughs> so she can give me some more praise. But uh, I, I thank God for everything. I, I want to tell you now, I, I didn't make the super mom. I was number nine. I ended up number nine. I didn't make the top five so that's okay because it was a lot of contestants across um the country and i was grateful to make number nine because so my name is out there my name is out there uh as a super mom uh but i thank you all i thank you all because many of you told me that you were going to vote every day and i know you did i know some of you donated votes votes and you did give it to a worthwhile cause the Children's Hospital Miracle Network. Great cause. But again, thank you, thank you, thank you. You know what my mama said, you don't miss nothing you never had. So I said, I wanted to win. Don't get it twisted, because I'm a competitor. When I get into something, I want to win. But I know all things is working out, still working out for the good. All right, all right, all right. You know, I... um. I, I read when I read the letters of Paul, you know, a lot of Paul's letters, he would start his letters by thanking people. He would end his letters by thanking people. I like to thank people because my mom always said, always thank people for whatever they do because they don't have to do it. And I just want to take a moment today. I want to thank people that watch me on this walking 1k with Gigi. It also watches during the week with um, Church School Live and 
life study and so forth. But I just want to take the time because I sat down this week and I looked at some comments where a lot of you from around the world are watching, especially Walking 1K with Gigi. I want to start with Samira Welday from Vajors Stegen, Sweden. He also supported our children's outreach project. I hope you're still watching. I want to start with my three main ladies, though. They watch me er, say er day, er day. <laughs> that's Diana, that's Jackie, and that's Lynn on the Gym Nugget channel and Facebook Live. I thank you because you know why I know they watching? They always send me words of encouragement. So I thank you ladies, you three ladies. I kind of call y'all the golden girls. I love y'all and thank you for encouraging me each day. But there are some other people from around the world. I done fell in love with Namila. Namila is in Sweden and she sent me a message. She said, always watching from Sweden, walking with Gigi. Thank you, Namila, uh, James Shaw, uh, R. Love, Amos from Kenya, Marianne Wanjiro, I hope I'm saying that right, uh, Martin from Kenya, Caroline Amata, I don't know, user XX1, I've seen you a lot from South Africa. Danny D, thank you for sharing how awesome your um, daughter is. She is a teacher, you know. One morning I was talking about uh, teacher's appreciation. I said, real heroes uh, don't wear capes, they teach. And uh, Danny shared about his awesome daughter that teaches. Oh my goodness, I hope she had a great week if she was in the States. Because I tell you, the teachers are counting down. I'm going to tell you right now. I walk with a teacher sometimes out on the track. And she told me, she said, counting down. I think it's about 18 or 19 days left in school. But I want to thank all of you. There are some others, um, some names I can't quite pronounce. But I thank you for watching me from all over the world. I really appreciate because I know that we're carrying out the mission to go into all the world uh, to teach all nations. Somebody asked me was I walking on Saturdays? Now I'm not, I don't usually walk on Saturdays but let me announce tomorrow will be a special edition of Walking 1K with Gigi and um, I'm going to be walking with our daughter in love, um, Lynette Gilmore. She's also the head of our AV ministry. And she's really responsible for helping GEM get on the map, I'm telling you. She's also a herbalist. Uh, she loves to uh, talk about and share about natural foods and eating right and so forth. And she's also a computer guru. So I'm really excited about her walking with me tomorrow and I look forward to I don't know what she's going to share but I'm looking forward to her sharing and you'll be able to see that at 10 a.m. tomorrow either on the Gym Nugget channel or Facebook live. Now if it rains, it says it's going to rain, we'll just sit in the car <laughs> and talk. But I hope it's not raining so we can get our walk in. Well, so for that person that was asking if uh, I walk on Saturday, uh, you are fortunate <laughs> because this is going to be one Saturday that I walk. Oh, people are so used to me walking, they just smile, say hi. But uh, <laughs> I thank, uh, thank God for that. And uh, I also want to uh, thank those that have supported the um, outreach project because this is what happens. Um, you can go to graceentwineministries.com, make a donation of any amount. Now what I'm changing this to, um, I had asked if you wanted to share a Bible verse, a word of inspiration, 
uh, and so forth. So I'm just going to say a Bible verse because most of the people that have supported it have shared their Bible verses. And I tell you, those words have been reaching out. Um, Miss Vanessa Johnson that had donated her verse about suffering the little children. Oh, we had many responses on that. And while I'm doing that, I'm thanking everybody again. Those people that have supported the uh, outreach project, I just want to thank again Samari Welday from Bajor, Sweden, Sweden, Mr. Rudolph Lawrence, Mr. Walter Moody, Jackie Jacobs, Kathy Worthen, Diana Carey, uh, Edna Dukes, Vanessa Johnson, and we have a few more, and uh, it's still on, y'all. We're still going on. So now, until the middle of June, please keep on. Send a donation of any amount, any amount, and your favorite Bible verse. And I'm going to share it one morning, walking 1K with Gigi. Those of you even in... Um, you know, that listen to me in South Africa and Kenya and um, uh, Sweden, Canada, all those places. You can do the same thing. Go to graceandtwineministers.com. You'll see it up there. Walking 1K with Gigi. And I would love to share your word. Now, the reason it's ending in June, because the last person that I'm going to be walking with on, I believe it's June it's the day right before Father's Day. I think it's June 15th. Is the father, I call him daddy too. Pastor JG from Grace and Twilight Ministry, my husband, we're going, he's going to be walking on that last special edition of walking um, 1K with Gigi, that Saturday edition. So he's going to be doing it in June, and that's when that project will end. Oh my goodness. Thank y'all. Thank y'all. Thank y'all. Okay. One more thing. Sunday is coming. Sunday is coming. And as always, we invite you to worship with us. If you're here in the Tidewater Hampton Roads area, come and worship with us at Grace and Twine Ministries. We're located at 3923 Deep Creek Boulevard in the city of Portsmouth, Virginia. You will find real love at the gym. And we would love you to come in person. But if you do not live in this area, tune in 10 a.m. This is nothing new. You can see the Sunday messages either from a week prior or two weeks prior on the Gym Nugget channel. Oh, yes, you can. Tune in at 10 a.m. And at the end of each of those sharings, uh, you will get an invitation to accept the Lord Jesus Christ as your Savior. And we want to know about it if you do. You have an invitation. We'll tell you how to be an online member of Grace and Twine Ministries. Real simple. And you, a prayer will be shared with you. A prayer will be shared with you at the end of each of our broadcasts on Sundays at 10 a.m. Yep, GM, we are covering everything, Grace and Twine Ministries. We are on the air, and we thank God for this medium of social media where we can reach the world every single day in some form or fashion with the love of Jesus Christ and His Word. Oh my goodness, I'm so excited. I hope y'all have a great uh, weekend and tune in tomorrow, 10 a.m., for my special edition of Walking 1K with Gigi. And don't forget what my praise nugget was today in every and all things give thanks. Bye bye.